Welcome to the back nine of Big Money Skins Championship right here from Eagles Crossing in Hawk Point, Missouri. 8,500 bucks Calvin's got accrued just from that front nine. Five skins for Calvin. I mean, he went on this tear. Tear. Absolute nice tear where it was just perfection. Every shot he threw, yeah. hardly had to even make a putt, winning yeah. five consecutive skins. But Paul Uliberry, $6,000 earned on the front nine. He's got three skins. Jakub Semerad has had some chances. In the end, he's got one skin for $1,000. James Conrad now, Conrad has been blanked, but he's been throwing great shots. Has been, yes. Nine more holes, we've got more money to give away, but more yeah. importantly, we've got a $50,000 check going home with one of these guys today. That's right, second in the order, that's Jakub Semerad. Let's get it to it. I don't care about this freaking 50 grand. What's my fantasy doing? Oh my goodness. Dropped it down into yeah, the slot. Yeah, boy. Swat. I think it's Calvin. They gave him the green flag. Clap, clap. Yeah, He's safe. Um, <laughs> safe. It's third in the order, right? I don't want to tell Well, you, no, you you're bottom. After me? I'm you third. bottom. You're fourth in the order. Oh, okay. All right, it, it goes it's James. You. Yeah. Yeah, my bad. Yeah, so I follow him. I thought you went after me for some reason on the last hole when he went over. Oh, uh, he did it and then he did it again. Yeah. Oh, he went again? Yeah, he threw twice. Damn. That was his second shot. Yeah, I go after Split them. He split, split them. Inside. Like that could be left side. Dude, that, that could, could be, be huge. Good. Dang, dude. I'm bad at this tee shot. I know, I, I saw you yesterday. The dreams. <laughs> Every time. Wow. I don't think you can really wow. dial it up much cleaner than that. Wow. Great that job. was pretty fantastic. Loved it. No claps for me, though. <laughs> they just like me more than you. Uh, <laughs> it was a dime, dude. It was a dime. I'm on the old side with the chats. This is going to be perfect. Oh, yeah. baby. Dude, nice early buddy. left is open wow. for play. They're clapping. We can, nice we can hear the claps, but wow. only barely over the wind right now. Yeah. It is ripping, skipping, flipping, you and You know dipping. what else you're about to hear, Jeremy? What's that, bye-bye? Dang, 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 yeah, dang, right. dang. <laughs> what is, what's the delay on this thing? Like, how it's long does laser. it take for it to reset? Yeah, oh, so the reset, I don't know. Good question, good question. Because if someone's oh. lagging behind your group and you get two dings, I feel I like that's one too many dings. Can you make uh -huh. one ding Let's is see perfect. if he gets it by yeah. himself, if he's big enough. See, you're saying he's oh, too skinny? Never mind. James is helping. <laughs> it's not going to be able to see Calvin. I was going to see if Calvin was the... That was his bag, that wasn't him. <laughs> yeah. Calvin's a large human. <laughs> How much do you weigh, Calvin? Like a buck sixty-eight. Ooh, who's I weigh got more the closest one-to-one -one <laughs> bag to body weight ratio? <laughs> Emerson. I'm, I'm weighing more than both. I was gonna of you. say like, uh, yeah, Paige no. Shoe. Oh, dude, that's why they didn't clap, bro. They clapped for me. <laughs> one of us is right by the tee pad. That might be me. That's you. I can tell by the rim. Double, double Close guy. Him. Man, this sucks. The mustard disc earned a second shot. It's, I don't know if that's the one here. Forehand roller. I like the forehand roller as well. He's going Mandarin Orange. Mm. Wow. That's so good. Kick a tree. Go left. Roll down a hill. Yeah. No roll, dang it. That's going to be a tricky up and down for the bird look, but yeah, that's a very solid second shot. Good advance. The play from there is just put yourself circle's edge and bang the putt. That's asking a lot. You get circle's edge from there? Yeah. That's a hard shot. I'm going to be on like a cliff face, 380 out. Dude. If anyone can do it, Calvin. It's someone else. It's probably uh, 
<laughs> Big turn. Big turn's got the stretch. Jakob. Oh, oh my gosh. Thought I was already past it. That's oh, the one that, looks that, sick, though, that uh, there's two on this fairway that I, I would, this I guy. might trip them. Yeah, yeah see, there's a couple you, that you probably. It, dude. Oh my oh. no. <laughs> Bench boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh Why my are you god. Laughing? The most comfy. I mean, your face. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Just line that shiz up, dude. Right comfy little shot. <laughs> Jeez. Be able to get... <laughs> what are you giggling about? You're the camera guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh, bummer. <laughs> Oh my god. It's a better lie. <laughs> so good. Like I I would have had to like go around it. We're probably in his run up. Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> oh, where am I? Uh, no. Oh, that's no. oh my god. Ah, Damn that looked good. Wow. Don't do that. God, this place, dude. Pretty nice. You think I should throw this guy again? He just got oh this and that. <gasps> I think I'll flip next time I throw him. I'm scared. Oh my God. <laughs> A one. Mmm. Big, big. Go, baby, go. Oh, wow. Kept hurdling. All right. Yeah. Good shot, bad. dude. Not bad. Yeah. I think I'm a little Yeah. Wow. Dude, my shot was so good on so many different levels of good. Oh, you gotta love it. Okay. Nice shot, James. Gotta love it. Beautiful, buddy. Wow. You got oh, wonderful. Man. Good shot. shot. Good drive. Maybe this I shouldn't be the good closest third. person to the player when I'm holding a, well, a good drive. pulled pork taco. Dude, this skins, dude. Do whatever you want. <laughs> Nobody told oh, me. Oh, what a shot. Nice shot, bro. Shot. Sick, man. That's what I said, man. Pat and Pender, stick her out. Put her to circle's edge. It's not just a gravel road either. The yeah, gravel let's, let's, oh. is made out of arrowhead material. This is like, seriously, what they made arrowheads. It's yeah, made to cut. People have been slicing, slicing and dicing for years out here, dude. <laughs> is this makeable? Can hmm. you throw that far? Yeah. Yep, it's makeable. How far is it, buddy? My team needs me. 268. 243. I'll tell. Plays like 268. 29. Okay. Whoa. Turns out we don't know anything. <laughs> One time. Yeah, it's makeable. Yo. Gross. Oh! Whoa. Whoa. Chuck, thanks. That was pretty good. Wow. Oh, yeah. Ooh, check shot, it up there. Nice shot. James. No, James. Off the left tree. Yeah. Vinny made it. Oh my goodness. In the heart. Vinny <laughs> grabbing another skin worth $2,000. There were a Good circle cut. this big that Thank you. denoted the center. <laughs> he would have just blasted it. Yeah. I like to think of that as the, um, the Adam Vinny wait, wait, Terry. Wait. Was that Birdie? Yeah. Yeah. Patent pending T Bird. Yep. How do you Birdie that? <laughs> 
Somebody needs to do something about Calvin, quick. <laughs> He's got mm -hmm. now $10,500, six skins. That's Getting closer and closer to that mark. Appropriate number of fingers, well done there. I finally got it right. All right, this is third in the order. Yep. Crazy downhill shot. 404 feet to the pin, Calvin up first. All right. Oh, I can't see anything. You wanna back up a smidge? Thanks. <laughs> Oh, uh, too flippy. It's not. It's too far, too. Holy crap. That's, That's a misjudge. 460 with a overstable putter. That was a misjudge. It's pretty beat up. <laughs> I used to be. It used to be. So I can. That might be a little short unless it gets a good skip. Ski. <laughs> I hit the rocks. No, James. Hit left. I guess it left. Case. No, he's in a creep like me. What are you doing, bro, man? I really didn't think I could overthrow it with that disc. The Toro? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, yeah. There it is. I like the height. There it is. Slow down. Slow down. Oh, my Shoot. gosh. Free T, everyone. I'm going for the win. Oh, what a layup, dude. Smart. What a bad layup. Oh, did it go B? Hey. All right. <laughs> How do you hold both play? legs? That's a bad What one. does that mean? I mean, essentially, they got to all run it. Because if you make it, it's money. Yeah, get in. Do we know if that first one's inbounds? They said yes. Okay. Thanks. I think James has to lay up. No, I think James has to lay up. He can't give Jakub a, a free chance at it. Oh, that was weak. What the heck? <laughs> Smart play. What the heck? It wasn't supposed to be that much of a layup. <laughs> what the heck? That's cute. Does Jakub normally get that nervous with his butts? No. Jammed it. Oh! Oh! oh. Safe. You stay safe? <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> nice. You stay green. Oh my gosh. I mean, I think we need more beatboxing on coverage. Yeah. <clears throat> Some people like it. Yeah, James. Uh, All right. Maybe it's closer than it looks from up here. It looked up like he still had 25 feet. Yeah. Oh, no. Well, the way Jakub's spotting, I mean, oh, that's a tapping, right? That's an absolute tapping, right? If Calvin gets one more skin, we're pretty much toast. Ah. After a push on hole 11, this hole, hole 12, now two skins and $3,000 on the line, Jared. 450 feet, pretty much feels like a straight headwind, a little bit of right to left, but down by the water, looks like it might be moving left to right. It's gonna be some tricky wind reads out there. <laughs> we got Rude. bottom of the order. All right, Calvin Heinberg's gonna <laughs> show us the wind, wind read. <laughs> yeah. Paul Yulbari. No, Paul Yulbari. <laughs> You're close. Just the way you were looking at me. I was just smiling. <laughs> These are the largest slabs I've ever seen used. I agree. Huge slabs. Ooh. No way. I don't think it has enough bite. bite. Yeah. Oh. Straight up. 
Wow. It did. Wow. First that drop safe. Dusty out there. That's never flipped ever. I mentioned it's 450, but I didn't really mention uphill or not. It's hard to tell. Pretty level. About to find out if she's still stable. Oh no. <laughs> so. Wow. Is it me? Mm, yep. Yep. Yeah. Calvin threw first and last one. Get down. Get down. Hit the deck. Unbelievable, dude. Oh, no. Calvin turning that one over. Wow. That is huge for Paul Uliberry. Oh, shoot. Kicking back in bounds. Oh, my God. Almost two guaranteed skins for Paul turns into most likely a push <laughs> to the next hole. A little $3,000. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> That's, That's insane. Crazy turn of events. And That's I mean, so and Calvin's the one who's hoping that Paul's not getting that right now. Dude, look at these fossils. That? That's so bad. Uh, I don't fossil so. shells, Germ. It burned out, burned out to the Whoa, that's some I pretty neat stuff. <laughs> oh, my. Okay, drop down. Yeah, I seen it. <laughs> I know. All right, I'm just man, that, that could have been push. two skins going Yuli's way. Instead, it looks like another push. It's gonna be three on the next. I'm calling it. And second shot doesn't stay. So it. it is. It does. Chuck. I love my line with my whole heart. They don't have another zero. Is he going to make it? Just ice us. Give it a good try. Yeah. Yep. Hey, right. this next hole is par four. It's never been played in this position. All right. Good job. You too. Well, the two guys that need it the most, want it the most, maybe. Yeah. Pushing it with each other, allowing guys like Jakob James to have a shot at this thing still. After hole 12, push again. Now three skins, $4,000 on the line, Jer. This is the first time we've ever played this hole as a par four, too. Yeah, it just continues the way that. Uh, the hole has played in the past, just a little bit longer. Yeah. These players haven't seen it, so they're just gonna have to go off what they know about the fairway. We're at the top of the order now, right? Yeah, that's virgin birdies right there. James Conrad up. Virgin virgins. Virgin birdies. Mine should have been LB2. Right. Startle. These 14 Yeah. Move away. Hmm. Where'd it go? <laughs> Is that in bounds? I think it's inbounds, yeah. I saw it land straight. Okay.
laced oh, it. Oh, yeah. It's got to get right, though. Yeah, I think it did. Even if it didn't, it's, it's, for trees. it's a good tee shot. shot. I think hitting this gap is paramount. Healy going trusted forehand, oh, yeah. hitting the gap, keeping himself in play. That's a yeah, good shot. He's got a noodle for that. Out. Yep, that's knowing your noodle right there. <laughs> mm. Mm. Um, all right. Where'd that go? Yeah. Right here. Somebody That's said, more impressive. Somebody said Gannon shot like a 14 under. And didn't win. I don't. Wow. Is that right or is that where we're He's looking right. at? That's right of it. Okay. It's not good. It's a kind of a force over Anheuser with the forehand, but you can't get a lot of break out of it. It's got to be gently turned over as to not get a lot of flex, just to stay on that straight line. And then the hard part is going to be putting the brakes on so before it scoots down the hill away from the target. Mm. This is a very narrow shot. Mm. Oh, I think he's wow, executed purity. the shot. Oh, oh my gosh. That was inches from it's absolute so perfection. You can't throw it much tighter than that and hit the line. I mean, that is just so close. There he is, looking very concerned. He's sitting there with Thomas behind us. He's hoping for a shank. Yuli did not shank. Yuli went long. Yuli has a putt. For three skins and a share at six. If anything, it's a little deep. Kill it? At the total. Like oh my gosh, what a shot. I like it like deep because I kept going and the camera kind of turned. But hey, that was as good as I could have thrown it. Yeah. early tree. Yeah. That yeah. eliminates everyone from this hole and except makes that Newly play. and Calvin. James is out of it. Just talking through some of the scenarios, this is yep. a pretty pivotal moment in our skins championship yep. right here. Yep. Paul Uliberry can convert, eliminate one of the Four competitors. And put one of them on the ropes. Sure. Yeah, if, if Yuli does make this, this would leave Yakub in a situation where he'd have to win the rest just to push a three players at six skin tie. You don't want to be there, man. No, that's not a spot no. you'd like to be at. No. Essentially, this turns this race into a two horse race. But uh, Calvin's not out of it. I mean, he's 65, 70 feet away. He's probably going to have an obstructed look at the pin. But he's, it's, he's done some pretty to... heroic things. Yeah. Water. Water. Take it easy on the edge. Nice. Stop. Oh my God. Just Calvin low the whole way on the line. But I don't think that ever had a chance to have the height right with Dude. that pine in the way. Actually, it's minus one for pull, Jerem. Oh no. So that's. Does that mean he's putting for a birdie again? Yeah. <laughs> this would be a sick four. Dude, I'm guessing in the bucket. Oh. Wow. All right, so here it is. This is one of the bigger putts Yuli will ever attempt in his life. Probably. Crazy to say. Right before the match, Yuli at practice with me doing uh, distracted putts where people were making sounds while he was putting so he can get himself ready for the situation. Wow. That's the kind of preparation it takes for three skins. God. Off left side chains, <laughs> four skins going to the next hole, and you know what that means. I say it, I'm not scared. I won't, shy, I won't hide Dude, behind this the This is what skins. it means, nobody's out of it. It Everybody's means no one's out of it, but it also means that everyone could be eliminated if Calvin were to win oh. these pushed holes. Ooh. It keeps everyone in it. Yeah. 
but it could also eliminate uh, everyone with the very next hole. Hole nine's a tricky man. one. Let's head there. After hole 13, we had another push. There are now this many skins on the line. Big guy knows it. That's 5,500 bucks in cash as well. $5,500 in cash. But the main thing right now, everyone's in it, but also everyone could be eliminated right now. If Calvin were to win these four skins, I would put him at 10, it would end the competition for the 50K. They would just be playing for the chump change afterwards. A plethora of scenarios exist. We're gonna go second in the order and start this thing up. That is Jakob Semenov. Yeah, buddy. I like Ooh. it. Getting that left move. I like yeah. that spot. I like that spot. That'll set up 400 to the pin. Well, actually, I don't know where the pin is. It's so pushed to the right, yeah. Yeah, 410, 400. Yep, but it's in play. I wondered if he was going to try and do this. Going for the second landing zone. Oh, he just crosses <laughs> over, hitting trees and Ike, he's just like in, safe. The, in the normal one now, right? It just hits you back to the pad. I don't know. I, I see it. I had a good win. I was like, maybe I get there. Paul going for the shorter layup zone. Yeah, that's the spot. And that is the oh, yeah. honey hole. Right there by Jakob. Yep. James going Ooh. the more direct route. That needs to stay That's up. Go across. That is going to be pushing it. And oh, red flag given. On the river, dude. It's a river. Yeah, that I found that river yesterday. I'm well aware that there is a <laughs> eight foot wide OB up there, and James has found it. You can't. Yeah. You can't pull it spot. Nope. Huh? All right, Luke. One more time. Yeah, it's deep. What do you think our order is? It's probably going to be Yui, Yako. I don't even know this time. And then you, me, then me, no. then you. Uh, either way, whatever. Four billion. Looks like. What are you doing playing disc golf? Okay. <laughs> this is a huge approach for Paul. Monster, dude. The wind is not really in the favor for the four. And he's gonna. This is gonna take every bit of what he has. <clears throat> that's a hundred percent. Sit down, that's a layup, dude. And it's that's coming up well short. I mean, it's inbounds. But I mean, what is this, yeah, dude? I, I don't think it's much closer than that. If it is, uh, he's he's relying on two things: an incredible shot from Jakub, or a mistake from Calvin. Yeah. Or super secret option number C. Terrible throwing. shots all around. Oh, or terrible <laughs> shots all. <laughs> got a little more power, a little bit more turn. If this stays clean, oh my. this is going to be monster. Oh my. So scenario A, Yakub throws a great shot, yeah. puts himself in position yeah. to push. That circle's edge. That's a big shot, boy, uphill. Thank you. Smash forehand. Yes. Very important. Right it now. is very important, you're not lying. So important shot, James. Ooh. This is a nice line yeah. drive. It's going to be finishing left, but he had to try to throw that one in. I think he's about to end it right now. This is not an easy shot. Even though he's got a great gap to hit, this is going to require a perfect shot. He's going to go low, I think, to avoid the wind push. He's going to go with a Firebird. Still a stable Frisbee. He's going to try to push this towards the high grass, towards the spectators over there in the out of bounds area. It's a lot of disc germ. Pushes it wide. Player skip he right gets the it. big skip. Wow. Wow. Spectators are already clapping. <laughs> I'm saying they're both circles edge short. It's so strong, it's literally taking the leaves off the ground.
Perfectly online. How did that not live, Tailwind bro? smashed it down. A good effort, to say the least. It puts the pressure big time on Calvin and Yakub. He would he would have taken the lead had he taken the three and the others not made their putt. A lot of scenarios can play out here, but Yakub looks like he's lining up his putt first, and that is ah uh, well. Oh, it's Vinny first. Who is going first? Okay. okay. Calvin Heinberg. He's going to have a straight headwind if anything it's a little bit off his right sh right side luke this could be the most valuable putt in the history of disc golf The top, Jakob. Oh, now Jakub. With a chance to get one back there, dude. dude. After those missed putts, he's had to, to still oh, be in there. Drop it. How much is this worth? Fifty-five hundred dollars. Maybe fifty grand. Wind dies. Jakub from twenty-five feet for fifty-five hundred dollars and five skins, and he misses it left side. Unreal, Luke. Unbelievable. Dude, he hasn't missed one right yet, has he? Everything has been left. So bad, dude. dude it's gotta be so painful. Not only do I not hit that putt, you don't hit that putt either. 5,500 bucks with the win, 50 Gs on the line. Come on now. Probably wouldn't have caught chains. Don't want to disparage our listeners, but, uh, <laughs> but yeah, I think you're right. I mean, <laughs> you can practice in your basement as much as you want. There's no way to practice a scenario like no, that. There's not. I mean, there's just, you can't practice feelings. You no. can only practice form. Reps. After hole 14, we had another push germ. This wow. is crazy, man. 6,500 bucks on the line now, five skins. I got sweaty palms for watching it. <laughs> I, I literally, this is this is pretty crazy right Anybody's now. Anybody's ball game, man. One shot is going to change one of these guys' lives. Literally, at literally. some point, somebody's going to throw a shot that's going to change their lives. Maybe forever. it's right here. We'll see. Who's who's order? I think it's Win Reed Heinberg over there. Is it? That's me. Yeah. I am. Tough decision. Go. It'll lift. What's it gonna do? It's not doing it. Nope. Mm. Wait a second. It's an off the water slide. You'll be asking for it to lift. Don't hit the Don't rock. Hit that sit. Rock. Fight. Fight. And a big skip. And inbounds. That is huge. Big shot. big shot. Just keeping one person in bounds is. I mean, we'll see how big that is. We haven't said James' name much today, but one big shot here. One time. Stop. Settle. Don't go long. Check. And that right there means God. that the Jakub card has is to be in bounds. begging for Jakub to stay in bounds. If he doesn't, that's going to mean a drop zone putt go for these three guys. Crazy gust. Look. 
Shit. Shot looks to be good. Oh, no. no. It, 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 rolls, no, it stayed in. It stayed in. I think it stayed in the it's corner. Like, see that green flag. They're holding green. Oh. Oh, there's Oh, I ruined your you shot. You never, did you? <laughs> yeah, I was just like clumsily eating popcorn. <laughs> eating popcorn and like falling over the edge. <laughs> Wind read. Ooh. Yes. Yes. I thought, well, I yes. Oh, nice catch. Thank you. Whoa, I thought we were celebrating the pass. <laughs> nice pass. <laughs> Oh, no. well, he's on the, the safe sideline. Wow. That's one of the biggest shots of the, the kid's career. Are they still dude. up there, though? With the... Yeah, I got to look. I don't know what everybody's talking about. Should I go first, about. or do you want to I go mean, back? I'm about to make that. Oh, that's long. Boop. Boop. No way. Go. James, oh. a great effort. But here it is, Luke. I Dude, mean, how Yaku, aggressive do you get? You have to get aggressive. You gotta try to go for the win. This right here would tie him at the top. Could you imagine what a storyline? Okay. Yeah. Now there it is. I don't I don't mind that. Paul's running this putt, no question about it. It's gotta be a soft bid at this point, dude. Yeah, soft bid, but you gotta be. You have to be. You cannot miss it short. You're right. Yeah, you can't you're right. miss it short. Without missing it short and going OB line. Oh my gosh, this gives is. this thing a bit somehow. Look at my palms, man. They're literally dripping sweat. They're this shiny. Insane. You got shiny palms. Wind is ripping left to right tail. This is a good win for Heiser Putter. He really likes is. the Heiser Putt. It is, dude. He can aim it straight at the chains and jam it in there. This would be one of the best putts of all time, man. That's right here. The condition. Him at nine skins. Game over. Go. Game over. Go. Oh. <laughs> I'm uh, It doesn't matter. We got six on the line. To it 20 feet in the air. Yeah. Wow. In the end. I don't know if there's a better hole for six skins to be on the line for either, dude. This one of my favorite holes on the course. So challenging. Live to fight another day, I guess. I think a birdie on this is worth $50,000 right now, man. Oh my gosh. All you see is water and white stakes. Oh, what a pin placement. This is the first time seeing this. This is gorgeous, gorgeous dude. Totally gorgeous. So fitting for a spot for somebody to change the history of disc golf then. After hole 15, we had Another push, the craziest way that you can push a hole to. How much cash on the line now, Jim? We got six skins. That's the most important thing. But we got $8,500. Dude. But six skins right now for any of these guys. For James, whose name we haven't said much, ties him up with Calvin. Yeah. For Yuli, it locks him up at least with nine. Yeah. Calvin, game over. Yakub takes the lead. This is potentially history changing hole in disc golf and it's one of the most beautiful holes on the entire property yeah worthy of making 50 g's on paul uleberry the wind read he is playing the safe shot to lay up in bounds that's perfect. It looks really good, Luke. Shot, Yuli. That gives him an opportunity to get aggressive on the second shot. Dude, that's I think what that is huge. Right Absolutely. Now. I don't know what the water carry is to get in the second island. Four. Four? Yeah. Okay, but that's 400 feet to a island green that slopes towards out of bounds water. Ooh. And any out of bounds shot goes to the red drop zone, which is essentially a nothing second shot to this long pin. <laughs> It doesn't matter how large the slab is, James is still gonna use this jump up technique. Hit something. Red 
flag for James' tee really shot. Bad, James. Turn the disc. 50% of the players have thrown and only oh, anybody hits one that, person in bounds. It, though, a three. But I just can't, with good faith, throw a shot to look good and be out of bounds. Just can't do it. Yakub aggressive. Going right at the tree. Out right. If that's clean, it's going to be huge. If it hits a tree, it's out of bounds. Out. It's out Never of got back. bounds. And now Man, Calvin has decisions so to make. Is he going to lay up or is he going to the go big? Same thing as I did if he's oh smart. Oh my gosh. He's got them both in his hand right now. Oh, he's got the Firebird. Yeah. He's got the Eagle. If you like drama, you don't need to tune into TNT. We got it right here. Oh, he's laying up. Smart one to do. That's match play for you. That should be fine. Shot, Vinny. He will be in bounds. That's a hard decision, huh? He will yeah. be first to throw, which means Yuli will have a clear indication of what he has to do with his second shot. Mm -hmm. And I don't think Jakob and James are completely no. out of it. No, I don't think so either. I mean, if they go huge here on the from the Red Sea and give themselves a shot at the par, they're still in it. Who knows? I, par, I don't, man. A par from the Red Sea would be one of the sickest approaches you can really make. I mean, yeah. there is just, it's almost a nothing burger of approach yeah. options. Yeah, it is. It totally is. How can we get there, Jakub? That's a good question. Oh my gosh, the height, the turn. It kept going. Is that good? Is that in bounds? Oh, wow, I think slightly overturned. That was amazing, though. So the commitment to the height and the angle was yeah. impressive. Got a tailwind here, Luke. I don't even know if that helps, Jeremy. It's not that it helps, it's just it might, you have to force over that Anheuser a little bit more. It's so good with this disc. Oh. oh, oh no! Just go Brutal. to bounce. Stay oh. in for stay for five. It in does bounce, stay in bounds. Keep someone honest, maybe. Yep. I see you. You freaking chip it up again. If you chip to get here, you chip again, bro. You think? Yeah. You don't. You don't think either one of these guys makes a play? That green is dice clay, bro. Yeah. You don't want none of that, man. Okay. It will be Calvin first. Like we said, Yulabari will be able to see what Calvin's decision is. Okay, decision time. This, this could be a decider. It's hard to make forward from here. Kind of. Is he going for the green? Hmm. Tricky. Um. I don't know how to run up. The destroyer? Yeah, he can. <laughs> I feel like he's got a. <laughs> Maybe he doesn't like all three or something? I don't know. Um, Oh, right now. Hmm. I do not know what I want to do. You, I thought you this was tricky. 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 
no guts, no glory. Crazy man. It's gonna be the destroyer. He gets the turn. Gotta he see. hits the gap. Gotta see. The speed. Wow. In. Yeah. Oh, there we go. There oh. hey, we go. There we go. That was about bat high off the ground. Crazy great shot. Calvin, give me some on that. What a shot, dog. What do you think That's about amazing. that? Hill? <laughs> great shot, Calvin. Yeah. Best shot the owner's ever seen on the hole. In this position, no yeah. way. Yeah. Forehand guy. I think crazy. I think it's the best shot anyone's ever seen on this hole. 25 feet. I don't think I can even get a sidearm there. <laughs> There's a thing. Feels like we forced our hand. I don't know. Yeah, I have to go over. He's 25 feet. <sighs> What's my number? Too far, I feel like. Three ninety. I got that in the back pocket, bro. Where's James at? <laughs> James, he's 25. You want me to go after it or? I can't make that call for you. <laughs> it's for all of That's us. That's a smart man I'm right there. I'm not. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's hard for me to bet on Calvin missing a 25 footer, but <laughs> I don't know. I hear you. I just don't think I can even get there. Let's keep the chance they were inaccurate with the 25 foot assessment. Maybe it's a little more, you know. Maybe it's less. He's gonna play his odds with the forehand zone. Unbelievable. He says you ain't got it, bro. Wow, wow, wow. He said you ain't got it, bro. That is some head games if I've ever seen it. We will see in a few moments whether or not I like it, dude. That play I like it. Off. it. Keeps him in it, man. Keeps him in it. Yeah, it keeps exactly. I, I, I just don't see a scenario. Where it was going to be. Where he could put one yeah. in close. Yeah. I mean, it was further down the fairway, but it was pinched on the angle. It would have been a completely different shot than Calvin threw. He misses that shot. It's over. It's over. He yeah. keeps himself in it with that play. I think it's the right move, but at the same time, you know, hindsight's 20 20. We'll find out That's soon. Fine. Vinny's never had a putt for yeah. 50 G's. <laughs> Is he deep, right, left, short? Nobody knows. Okay. All right, so does the layup play work out? He's got to put this close. The layup play was all for naught if this isn't stuck. Don't roll, don't roll, don't roll. All right. Wow. Let's put it close. Oh my gosh. Game plan executed, Jerm. Jakub has the chance. He can throw his shot in. That's for four. That's four. Yeah. yeah, I mean, it's the same thing that Paul's playing for. Either way, nothing can stop Calvin from having an opportunity now to make the richest putt in disc golf history. Mm. He's got 25, 20 up the hill with a tree in the way and a straight right to him. And also $50,000. I think you made a smart call. Yeah, we, we were commending you for 
making the right play. Yeah, keeping yourself in it. But I mean, if I don't do it, then none of us have a chance. I know. I, no, I'm with you. The richest yep. putt in disc golf history yep. about to be thrown by Calvin yep. Hyman. I'm going to go ahead and record it on my phone. I, well, actually, I can't do that. No recording, Jim. All right, well, I'm just going to take a picture. You know the rules. I'm going to take a picture. <laughs> All right, take I'm, I'm going to take the video. <laughs> Let's call it 19 feet. Yeah, maybe 21. 22. 22 feet will settle on that. Yeah, yeah baby! Woo! And disc golf history was just locked down. Calvin Heimberg. Heimberg $50,000 richer. Unbelievable, man. This is a moment for disc golf, right? This is history in the making. It was just bound to happen the way he's been playing all day. I mean, put himself in position hole after hole after hole. In the end, my goodness, one of the best forehand shots we've seen. Low ceiling, this high off the ground, 400 feet, put himself 20 feet away and knocked down the putt. Earned it. Incredible. Give me some, bro. <laughs> well done, man. Yeah, dude. Thanks. Yeah, dude. Oh, wow. Oh, my Thank goodness. You. Oh, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go, buddy. You look calm, but there's got to be 100 miles an hour going oh, on. Oh, it's there. racing. <laughs> it's racing. <laughs> All right, we're here with Calvin Heimberg. Just took down the largest purse in disc golf history. One of the best forehands you've ever thrown had to be, right? Yeah, that was, uh, I don't know. I didn't really know what to do there. I just didn't want to like mess up laying up and then lose that way. So I figured just go for it. I had a weird run up, but made the island definitely the most incredible forehand I've thrown all week. And um, what were the feels like standing over that putt? Uh, definitely a little nervous, but nothing too bad. It was just like wind inside the circle, wind was swirling a little, but uh, less nerve wracking of a putt than I was that second shot. Second shot, I really had no clue what to do. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm sitting here in disbelief. The shot choice, you went back and forth between the Rhino and the Destroyer. You ended up going with the trusty Halo Destroyer. Yeah. And when you piped that out of your hand, I was worried that you were gonna hit an OB state because it was inches off the ground, yeah, was narrowly good. missing them left and right. Mm -hmm. When it got through that gap, it looked like it was home free. You still had to avoid the roll on the side hill, but it yeah. ended up nestling. You have just taken home the biggest purse in disc golf history. Yep. Now you gotta play two more holes. Yeah. 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 Well. It's all fun now. Yeah. All right. all right, 1500 bucks on the line. Back to the top of the order. Still got more money to earn. James right. Conrad. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Pushed all the way to the end. It was really close. Wow. Yakub still looking for some check party money. He's going high, Heiser. Wow. All the way up there. I just want that. Shot, Yakub. That looks like a pretty good shot. Yeah. It's left side, but it's nice. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, when you can't, he can't win any more money. <laughs> 50 G <-er. laughs> Yeah, you, you can't win any more money. You might, you can just walk the holes. Let the other three guys play He's for some extra cash. That's true. He literally, yeah. he literally can't make it all money. <laughs> all he can do is ruin the party for someone else. <laughs> all right. All right, buddy. Oh, oh Yula Boy. Oh, yeah. Go and flip up Heiser. This oh, yeah. is one of his. That's that's his preferred angle out of hand, and he smoked it. That was a great shot. Oh. <laughs> Hangover still intact. <laughs> Like, why is he playing with us? <laughs> it's true. <laughs> if he doesn't hit every tree, our friendship is going to be in shambles. <laughs> 2,500 on the next hole, too. <laughs> nice. Dude, that's going to go down as, like, 
I don't think I've ever seen a better sidearm shot. Situationally. Dude, but it was probably so, the wrong choice. That's as far as you could throw it, right? Pretty much. I mean, without the run up, really, yeah. I mean, I didn't have much of a run up, you know? I just feel like if I throw anything with. Whoa. Where is that? Oh, that's good. Wow. That's good. Nice shot. Oh. Thank you. I don't know if you saw it come down, but it's up there, bye. Chance to hit, take home some more uh, some more gas money. 1500 bucks, man. Yeah. It seems like nothing compared to what's out here for play. I know, it's weird. But $1,500 is an A tier it's win? It's weird, yeah. <laughs> a tier on the whole, yeah. man. Now I get the love. Hot dog right now. Pick it up, Vinny. What if I throw it in for fun? <laughs> what's he doing? What? Dude, I don't even know. He's risking injury. Packing right it in now. the woods, dude. This is when you're up 20 points and you still got the starters in and there's a minute left. <laughs> that coach is getting fired, dude. Bench. <laughs> Bench your starters. <laughs> Jakob Simrad, this is to it's to push it's to, to annoy Paul one more time. It's out of bounds. Oh, now you can Paul, you can hear me. Thanks, man. Hmm? Thank you, right? Yeah. Don't think too much about this one, you. <laughs> I don't even want to talk to you anymore. <laughs> After hole 17, Paul Yulbari adding 1,500 bucks to his total of now 7,500. 7,500 bucks, and we are one hole away from crowning this man and giving him a trophy on one of the best greens in disc golf. Man. The cake hole, as it is affectionately known, and it will be bringing a lot of cake back home yeah. to Florida for Calvin Heimberg. Mm. Paul, what a battle that was. One hole late to win the skins, but it's still well played hole there on hole. Traditional speed, but yeah. course 17. Yeah. Got one left. Yeah. Who's one box left. is it? 2,500 bucks. This is second in the order. That's going to be Jakob Simmer up. Yeah. Albatross. Is, this is the last one? Last one. Good Good playing with you. It's playing. Yeah. Yeah. Playing with you. Congrats, Congrats and good playing. playing. Good job. Thank you. Good, good playing with you. Good playing with you. Good playing with you. Good playing with you. I think Jakub's got really 450. In this situation. I think he's got it and then some. Wow. I think he's got it and then some. Wow. That was every bit of 500. Um, I don't know. Pound for pound, not many throw it farther. I don't think I can get across. 500? Yeah. 520. Calvin Allheiser clears with ease and settles on the fringe of the wood line that should open up a pretty manageable second shot. The wind out there is going to be a lot stronger than it is here at the tee. Yuli going to hyzer to Go. the shorter side. That's no worries, really. Yeah, no. I think that's it's a good angle. A good yeah. shot there. Yeah, yeah. And you, Just I, saying before he stepped on the tee, yeah. I don't think I can clear on the straight. He there. played it to where he could, and it was oh. a great <laughs> shot. <laughs> there you go, Hogan. <laughs> right on time. Okay. He picks one person that scans to work, and unfortunately. Last time I was here, he got me. He got me on a circle one. James goes one photon. Last time he knows I was here. Yeah, you don't need to watch that one. It's gonna be safe, it's gonna so, be left. Oh yeah. yeah. The dog worked me. It's one Scott one, Stokely one. Yeah. Like two holes later, Scott won them all. I would have won the entire skin because I already had enough. <laughs> that was like a 25 footer. That's funny. It was like a, I don't know, 10 to 15 gram putt. <laughs> no, there's just no, I don't think there's a possible way to make the headwind in this much wind on that basket. You just throw it up the first tier and it rises all the way yeah, up. Yeah, that's the only way. <laughs> what did you hit your eagle putt on? What wind was that? Um, I hit it a couple of times and I think they were, I was always on the left side, so I was always a headwind. How is it a straight headwind now? I'm gonna wait a sec. 
<laughs> yeah. Crazy. It did. Yeah, it kind of shifted, didn't it? Full send, oh, Paul Uliberry. There's the right to left, the on the left and it is should be perfect. Throwing it left. In bounds, it is. Woo. No look for the eagle, but a great shot to get Don't in bounds. And James is going with a panic. He showed us earlier that when they were playing the train wreck hole, one of his shots chunked up the disc. Yeah. The next time he threw it, it was considerably more understable. You okay? <laughs> Is that his skin shirt? Oh, that's so far left. That shirt in Delaware oh, wow. 13. That's it. I like the putt from over there. Yeah, so Calvin doesn't care about what I say about the headwind putts. He's intentionally leaving himself a strong headwind. I think that this just with all that mud on it flew weird. Oh, with that shot, Jakub is going to get a pretty decent wind read. Let's see if he makes an adjustment and. All of this Maybe. are going left. He's got to hang this thing out. Except mine. Did mine go left? Could he chunk it? <coughs> there it is. There Ooh, is the, the adjustment. That's too wide. It's going to be left it's as well. It's still going to give him a headwind putt. It's just so hard to <laughs> trust it at that width. Still a really fine shot. Thank you. James pulling out the old fireball. That's going to be left. Nice. That's a fun shot to watch. Hogan. Aogi. Very important. What is that? Very important that you have this. There you go. That's my gift to you. <laughs> this is another skins legend. Still hasn't won a single skin yet. Hogan is. <laughs> He's won a lot of sticks. Zero skins. So we got some shots at some money here. How much is this hole worth for these guys? $2,500. bucks. $2,500. $2,500 $2, putts. For the glory, Paul Uliberry. Yeah, this is the glory right here. Give it a dapper. Got right up to the chains and installed and high. He's gonna win this, isn't he? Oh, almost. That's twice how, now. That's how you beat the headwind. Only you can twice go ahead. now. You keep it rising and you put some freaking pace on it. Yeah. That is the way to beat the headwind. Yeah. I tried. You did. Jakub, this would be saving more than, yeah, big pay, putt. Pay for the flights back to the Czech Republic right here. Get it, brother. Oh, Jakub, off the mark. I think Perfect. that was right that time. It was finally right. On the third tier, so I have it pretty down, easy. Man. Easy put. Oh, I guess I'm trying to make mine then. Yeah. <laughs> now I am. Why? You're the nemesis. <laughs> just, I, I, all right, I'll take it. That's fair. You're my nemesis. Oh, God. Yeah. And Calvin, he right. misses. That was the one that okay. purpose. Yeah, that's, I'm kind of annoyed they even tried to make it. It looks like Paul is pretty close for the birdie. This is for an even 10 G. It's oh not my 50, God. but Jakob's gonna have one more shot at it. Are you up there? I like, think right I next am. to it. You, you probably should just right. go. You should probably tap it out. Ten thousand dollars. Yeah, you're and close. our pyramid yeah. suffering. Ten thousand. This pot for twenty five hundred and even ten k for the day. I mean, what? It's a sh what? Yes. The birdie goes to Paul Uliberry and the last two skins. Thank you, sir. Thanks. Ladies and gentlemen, that concludes the Big Money Skins Championship. All we have to do now is give away that beautiful trophy. To give away the trophy, we're going to bring in Eagles Crossing owner, Philip Samuel. Come on up. 
Let's give a hand for Philip Samuel for putting all this on. On behalf of Eagles Crossing and all our staff and all the people who have helped us put this event together, I want to thank all of you. I want to thank my wife. I want to thank everyone to come to support this event today. We are very great, grateful that you're here. And this is, for the record, the very first ever golden Discman trophy from Eagles Crossing for a Skins Match event, the Big Money Skins. Congratulations, Mr. Heimberg. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> All right. What's that feel like right there? First gold trophy in disco. Uh, it feels amazing. Um, Pretty heavy. Uh, it's decently heavy. It's probably the biggest trophy I've ever gotten too. But um, yeah, it feels great to uh, come out here and fight through all the rounds and uh, come out on top. Um, I love playing skins, so. I was just stoked to finally make it to the last two rounds where I got to play skins and uh, to come out with the win is more than I could have ever asked for. What was the uh, environment like on the card? Was there camaraderie going on, camaraderie going on or was it uh, some trash talk or was it kind of just focused today? I would say there was less today than most days. Uh, tensions are probably, were definitely higher. I mean, there was more money on every hole than you know we've ever played for. So uh, maybe a little here and there, but I definitely didn't give as much as I normally would. Talk about the nerves coming down the stretch there. We've never seen anything that compelling going into those final holes with that much money on the line. Every hole, someone had an opportunity to take home maybe the skins that would have shifted the match in their favor. Yeah, I mean, it was, um, there was a lot of opportunities out there. And then, you know, coming down, I think five or six were pushed to the, that hole where I ended up winning them on. And um, at that point, everyone was still in it. Like anyone, anyone could have won. So, uh, you know, um, I don't know, I threw an incredible second shot on that hole and um, was lucky enough to come away with the win. One more time, let's give it up for your champion, Calvin Heinberg. Congrats. Thank you. Oh, close it. Yeah.